Hey guys, it's Jax, and today I'm going to show you how I created this eye look. Um, if you want to see how I achieved this look, just keep watching. Also, make sure to bring it out all the way, like extend it past your brow tail. The tail of your brow. In with the bright pink and the bright orange. Applying it mainly on the outer part first and then working my way in. She said we all made in Hollywood. Fake loving and hating on silver screens, believing everything we come to see. Go outside if you only downside on this side is um, my yellow liner is very dried up, so I'm gonna try to go in and fix that later, but we'll see what happens. Paper blending brush and go in with the pink shade, the hot pink. Place that in the crease. Right. So now I'm going to go in with this brush on this side and take a little bit of the white shape. Taking this brush again and kind of going over it, not adding any product. Now I'm taking the lighter pale orange, placing it right here, but like very lightly. I'm not going in heavy. Back in with the pink. I just want where the cut's going to be very intense with the pink. So that's why I keep going back in and layering. All right, so I'm gonna pause here, and then I'm gonna go in with my Maybelline Master Conceal, conceal a brush, and making that cut. For the other base, I'm going in with Drug Lord and Breakfast at Tiffany's. Yeah. Sorry, sorry if you can barely hear me. Um, I have my fan on, and it's 100% necessary that I have it on. I'm taking a Morphe E43 brush, and it's like a square flat precision or smudging brush I guess. So that's that. Those are the base colors down. I'm gonna go in with my finger in the center and just kind of pat it out. But yeah, that's that. Now I'm gonna go back in with this brush and go in with the white shade and a little bit of the bone shade and just kind of set that center part.
now I'm gonna go in with these two shades here and here and mixing them and I'm going over the base of the blue. I'm going in with a little bit more of a precise brush. I'm taking this palette and taking this shape here um, and going over those same areas. with this brush, I am going to take the lime green shade mixed with this blue shade a little bit. Darker seafoam green from the 35B palette. On the Mikasa E110 brush. What I did wrong with the liner on my other eye was basically I did the glitter first um, and it made it a lot harder. Um, doing the liner before the glitter will make it a lot smoother. Another thing is I added in a little bit of Jeffree Star's um, Drug Lord liquid lipstick and it made the liner a lot smoother to work with. Let's just see what comes to Okay, to clean up the rigid lines a little bit, I'm gonna go in with this precise brush and dip into the hot pink that I've been using and kind of just carve it around wherever I see fit. They are both uh, size four, Spark and Margarita. Um, so what I'm gonna do, I'm using Spark mainly on the center part and like a little bit over the lime green bits and then I'm using margarita on the green bits. So, and for the liquid base, I'm using liquid sugar um, from eye candy glitter. And I'm just patting the uh, liquid on with my finger. So like so. I'm gonna go off camera, finish my face, um, well, my foundation and bronzer, and then I will be right back to finish the eyes. Um, so I'm going to highlight the brow bone using I'm Peachless by Makeup Geek. We just see everything we believe. Precise little this brush, whatever. With the seafoam green right there, and just blending that out as well. and the shade mixed. I'm taking a little bit. I'm taking a little bit of this dark green right at the tip of the brush and pushing that against my lash, my lash line. Now I'm going in with number 84 yellow gel liner by Inglot. You only want to chase the feeling again. Let's be friends. You only need what's best for you and not them. Don't pretend. Now I Let's just 
Now I'm just gonna apply mascara and lashes and I'll be right back. Okay, so for the highlight, I'm going in with the wet set as the base and I'm gonna use Privacy Please and Unbothered mixed together. I'm going over with Melt Cosmetics Gold Ore Highlight. Okay, this is pretty, but the tone is off. So I'm gonna go over with Posh Spice by Jeffree Star. Yeah, I think that's a lot better. So I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video. If you did, please give the video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you are not already. Also be sure to click the little bell button below next to the, I think it's next to the user icon. You'll be notified anytime I post a video. Also be sure to follow me on my other social media like Instagram and my Facebook page for makeup if you want to see more looks from me that are not on this channel. Um, I'll have that right here. Um, also, if you want to be my friend on Snapchat, I'm gonna leave my icon right there so you can screenshot or take a picture of it and add me. Um, but yeah, um, I hope you guys enjoyed the video and um, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the video and enjoy the rest of your day, night, whatever time of day it is where you are. And I'll see you in the next one. <laughs> I won't really see you, but you know, like. YouTubers, they do that, so. Oh God, I make myself very uncomfortable.